Hello everyone, my name's Zillier2 and welcome back to my Let's Play of Civilization 4 with the Caveman Cosmos mod with the Empire of, of America. I almost said Mexico. What the hell? Uh, anyways, in the last episode, we finally started getting some money again by getting uh, medals for our uh, currency, which is good because we do have some silver copper i guess i don't believe we have any gold though odd uh damn portugal is just there we should colonize no you know i think i'm gonna ignore it we won't colonize down in uh, greece i guess we'll let them have it i think they're gonna take over italy yeah it looks like they've taken over um iberia as well and uh, yeah all right so let's continue on so 20 gold per turn that is amazing like, that was a huge increase. That's like 30 gold we started making. It's amazing. Absolutely amazing. And, uh, well, yeah. Now we just sit around and keep building up. Uh, try and get as much technology as possible. And we have some, yeah, armies in the area. But it doesn't really matter. It's aight. Alright, and you know what? Get an Elder Council. More technology. Always helps. And go ahead and, and get a mine for that lead. Luru has been discovered and Basalt Oregon has been discovered. Good. Scouts, yeah. You, you guys are not crossing into our borders. Sorry, you're not. You're, like, never going to be able to at this rate. God damn, the Confederacy. They are powerful. Everyone is pretty much powerful. Like, we're only stronger than the Byzantine Empire and everyone under them. And the Byzantine only had three. We have six. Six fucking cities. Actually, if I looked at demographics... Where's my population at? Whoa! Rival best at 10,500? Holy shit! That must be the Confederacy. It has to be a Confederacy. Life expectancy is higher and approval rates higher. Ooh, they're so cool. And they're much stronger than me. They have a higher crop yield. We just had a crappy start, to be honest. Moscow is not a good area to have. Yeah, lead ore gives you two um, disease, which is not good. But we can survive it. That's fine. Lead gives us a ton of production anyways. So we're going to use it. Get as much as possible. Look at that. We're now making 21 gold. Uh, problem is we can't keep getting, uh, can't, can't keep, uh, doing lesser research. We need to start building other things. So, um, it's gonna be a while. Wow, Russia, you are a horrible nation. You guys are now getting farming. That is sad as hell, Russia. You guys need help. All right, go up and get these, um, beavers. All right. And what can you build? You really can't build anything, can you? No. Go over there, build a farm. Why not? Tear down the trees. Fuck the trees, man. Alright, now we're getting community. What were we going for? I think we were going for a uh, masonry, I believe. I believe it was masonry. It could be horribly wrong, though. Mm, well, yeah, Portugal is also very strong. We're at 0. 0.7 their strength. Not good. And they're our number one rival, probably. What are you we don't hate each other, but we're rivals. So right, Elder Council. Go ahead and get lacquerware. And get more lacquerware. Lacquerware. Now, I just want to check. How's religion? We are not the largest. Shamanism is the largest religion. There's Tanguism and Mesopotamianism. Which, actually, Mesopotamianism is quite large. Surprising. Alright. And you, my friend, could go over here. And get a mine. Not a mine. A farm. Farms. Hard. Words. Hard. Uh, okay. Go up here. Actually, are you going to turn into a... Cannot turn into a mine. Oh, it must work it to become a mine. Okay. That makes sense. You know, go and get, go and get this uh, stone. Don't know why you're not getting the stone now. Um, this will turn... Ooh, 20 turns to become a mine? That takes forever. Alright, so just to check... How, what, what are we going for here? I believe it was mason. Yes, masonry. All right. So we still have... Uh, we, well, we're going to get the wheel. That's good. Uh, and we have a ton of other stuff. All right, good. I believe... Yeah, we are kind of behind on um, the old research. 
Which sucks, admittedly, but... You know, we'll, we'll, we'll keep trying. We will keep pushing on. Look at these people. They're taking like 16 turns just to get mining. We're ahead. And then there's the fucking Confederates getting metal casting. And it's like, oh yeah, no, it takes us three turns to do it. Like, what the fuck? How are they so powerful? I'll never know. I'll never know. Go ahead and get a furrier. And... Get knowledge inheritance. All right, you know what? Let's stop getting all this lesser research. Start going for some other stuff. I'm sorry, but that's just the way it has to be. Okay, I get lacquerware. It's really going to help. And this is probably going to fuck us over, but I want you to get a granary. Yeah, so we can get 30% food after growth. That's really going to help out. All right, and get an early quarry. Right? That's what we want? Yep. Good. Go ahead and build that. Rhinoceros Trainer, holy shit, someone's gonna have Rhino Riders. Those, those must be powerful. Probably, I don't know, they, probably not as powerful as Mammoth Riders or Elephant Riders, but, you know, definitely powerful. I mean, Rhinos are great at attacking. Because, you know, they're fucking Rhinos. Right, it's a granary, you're nice and strong. Go ahead and get a Lacquerware Hut. Gives us a ton more money. All the money, all the time. You, you too can get a granary. And you can get a granary. Right, it's ABC order. Remember that. Uh, wait, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm an idiot. I can't... Wow, I forgot my alphabet. Good job, Ailier. Good job. All right, and... A lichen gatherer. Just a little bit more production. Always nice. A mining camp. More production and gold. That's sweet gold. DC is going to level 11. And... Oh, I thought you kept 30% of your food. Never mind. Whatever. But with 11, you are definitely nice and big. How many people live in DC right now? I want to check that. Take your time. Don't worry. No, no, that's fine. Really. There you go. He... Really? No. Fuck you. Dude, you're strong, yeah, but you're on the other side of the fucking continent, so no. Um, anyways. So, what does Town Hall do? More stability, more maintenance. Ugh. Production of city council increase. I don't care about that. Um, mining camp? Yeah, go ahead, go crazy. Elder Council built. Get a wet nurse's hut. More health. Health is nice. And you two can get a fox a fox hunter's camp. Alright. It's cool, I guess. Go out here and get a mine. Alright, you guys have completed. Go out here and get the other lead. Look at that. 66 gold, because we have so much production in DC. It's amazing. A Syrian city of Angle took a direct hit from a powerful hurricane. I didn't know they had hurricanes that far north, but whatever, I guess I'm just an idiot. <laughs> you know, fuck me, I guess. Come on, take your time. Alright, so now... You shall get mounted. You know what, let's get a stable. I'm pretty sure... Mammoth Riders are considered mounted units. That only makes sense to me. So, whenever they're built up there, they're going to become powerful as hell. Alright, and... Ooh, yes. Go to that area and get a farm. Some more food in DC. Okay, sorry. I wanted to check. How many people live here? 4,000 people. And for the ancient era, that is a lot of people. Two great prophets have been born. Good for whoever built them. I kind of want a great merchant, but a great prophet will be good as well. Maybe I could start a golden age in golden age. Ooh, that'll be good. That'll be real good for us. All right, got a stable here, and... Really? Nothing? Nothing else? Hmm. I suppose... Ooh, a bakery. Yeah, more food and production. And production. Blah. 
All right, you too. Yeah, get bakeries. Bakeries are nice. Can you build a bakery? No, you cannot probably because you don't have any um wheat or anything. All right, and childbirth hut. All right, there you go. Get up. A farm. Destroy the forest, but that's alright. Alright, and you are going to turn into a mine. I thought you were. Right, can we not build a mine here? That's weird. Whatever. Uh, this is amber, right? Yeah, we could build a mine up there. Golden Age has ended for the Assyrians. Good. They deserve it. St. Paul will grow to size 6. So, are you guys doing all the, um... Fish and stuff. No, actually, fish is not a major area. No, let's go there then. That's fine. I'm sure they'll collect fish, more fish eventually. Yeah, yeah, ticks, cockroaches, and longhouse. All right. <laughs> they built a longhouse. They didn't build the pest or ticks or cockroach. Or the ticks and cockroaches and shit. All right, so with the bakery, you guys can now go ahead and get writing. Ooh, writing school. Yes, new mounted units, even faster. Oh man. Okay, so fifty percent faster training of all the horse stuff, which is good. It's good, you know. Rather it also include the mammoth riders, but I guess not. All right, bug catcher, get earthworm gatherers. Right, go ahead and build the mine. Get a ton of gold from that. And... Yeah, just go north. Go ahead. Go north. And... Ooh, copper. You have stuff like copper and shit. Yeah, I want that. Alright, and... Uh, where... The Confederacies keep jumping ahead. Oh, uh, what, what did they just adopt? They adopted something. That's why it's taking them 1,600 turns. St. Paul's grown to size 6. Good. More people. Come on. Alright. Bakery is finished. Go and get... Myth of Metal. Eh, sure. More myths. Oh yes. A mining camp. Good. Childbirth hut. Get a reindeer farm? No. Rope weaver. weaver. Uh oh. Vermin. Well, yeah. We can pay 21 gold. We get 33 every turn. So it's... It's okay with me. Uh-oh. A locust swarm. Not a good thing. Yeah, why don't you guys just hide in New York? Just stay there for a while. Avar is going to size three. Good. All right, now we're finally getting the wheel. Oh, it has been a long, long wait, but we're finally getting the wheel. And that will allow us to create actual roads. Mud roads, I believe, which will help in... um. Movement speeds. And it will look a lot nicer. And there goes that mine. Fantastic. I don't know how locust swarms destroyed a mine, but they're locusts. Whoa! Look at all these tails and myths and shit. Well, we could definitely build all those, but I don't want to. You know, let's get a trail get more trade routes to DC. Always nice. Oh, a hat shop. Earthworm Gatherer. Mining Camp. Please. Please and thank you. And a Lycan Gatherer. Alright. So you guys go ahead and kill that Locust Swarm. And you go up and rebuild that mine. Is this an ancient forest? No, it's just a normal forest. Just oddly colored. Okay. The borders of Yatswafrofora. This place is about to expand. Good. So now we basically secured all this area. No, no, the mine was destroyed by the Barbarian Locust Swarm. Small. See, they can get a lot bigger and a lot more dangerous, so... That's gonna be kind of hard. How do you destroy a Locust Swarm? You really can't, I guess. You can just survive it. By trails. So with that, I think we gain a little more money. Go ahead and get a Straw Gatherer. Wow, we don't have a Straw Gatherer there yet? Damn. Alright, and Mining Camps. Hat Shop. Go Lumber Camp. And Juggler's Booth. Alright. Yo, Assyria, can we just have peace? Thank you. Awesome. So now, keep getting forest, uh, for, forest worker. Bleh. 
Any other resources? No, you have like, no resources up here. Sad. You're not gathering these mushrooms? Oh, we should. Alright. Um, actually, why don't you move down there and heal? New York needs protection. It's more important than a, um, a worker. Sorry. Oh, who declared war? A violent revolution again, Russia? What the fuck is up with Russia and revolutions, huh? And it's the Japanese. Japanese rebels of Moscow. I need to discover the Japanese. Like, they must be a very big powerhouse. Look at that. The wealthiest nations and I'm the forgotten. I'm in eighth fucking place with wealth. That is honestly quite ridiculous. All right, you know, I want to check... Oh, no, yeah, they do get 8 XP. Oh, my God, that is amazing. With 8 XP, that's huge. The bull Leaping and Mercenary Stables. Well, can't get Bull Leaping. I think that's a uh, world wonder. Lee is now the worst enemy of Ashrabanpal. It was me. Oh, good. Going to get uh, Music Huts. And a river, a river Port. Yes, please. Yas, yas, please. All right, Rope Weaver's Hut. And go ahead and collect those shrooms, son. All right, and I get the mine again. And you can go ahead up to that silver area and mine. All right, so now you're done through here. You can continue to get the salt. Oh, no, we already have that. Sorry. Um, go up and get this copper. You've been waiting for it, so we need it. All right, fortify until healed. And continue on. Look at that. 38 per turn. Jesus Christ, we can create a lot of soldiers now. A lot of mammoths and um, cavalrymen. They'll be nice. Nice to have. We can easily destroy basically everyone around us. We are definitely the most powerful in Europe. Okay, well, I guess right now... Technically, Portugal is the most powerful, but you know what I mean. You guys get it. All right, get a um, tablet maker. We need tablets. And a smokehouse. And you guys get a skinner. And you guys get a public stoning. No. A, st a sage's hut. Oh, nice. All right, and woodcarver's hut. Good, good, good going go keep going giraffe trainer holy shit someone's gonna have fucking giraffe riders that that honestly that's just cool that's just cool like it's not even useful it's not powerful or anything i mean they're fucking giraffes they're not the strongest creatures on earth especially when you have mammoths but a giraffe train oh man i love alternate history shit good it's real good all right uh reindeer farm please and thank you and grass gatherer oh an outhouse yeah you guys are probably not shit in your you know homes all right go ahead and get the mine lee will trade cotton you know lee i am okay with that want you want to trade cotton well we can trade uh Shit. We can trade our culture. <laughs> we can trade something simple. Mushrooms! Oh, yay! Good, good. Now, a sweet old cotton. We probably have some more buildings because of that now. Good job, uh, Confederacy. I like it. I don't know how they have cotton in Africa, but whatever. I thought cotton was an Indian thing. Perhaps I'm wrong. Look at that. DC has too much production. Minneapolis has too much production. Always great things to see. Alright, and... You know, I think it's time to go back to research. And look at that. Saved us an entire turn. Oh, okay, yeah. There you go. Now, two more turns. So we just chopped our research in half. Go ahead and get a tally stone. And... Oh, yeah, get a stable. Or a pasture here. And get a mine for kappa. Let's get the kappa. And we'll finally get the fucking wheel. It's only, you know, 
1000 BC and we're getting a fucking wheel. I guess that's pretty good. I don't know when the wheel was created. Maybe like 5000? 5000 BC? Maybe. I don't know. Come on. And stay just hot. Alright, go ahead and get a slaughterhouse. And look at that. A level 3 field worker. That's okay, I guess. And now, return home. Finally. Hopefully, we don't have another fucking locust swarm. The Library of Nineveh and the Labyrinth of Gnosis. Someone, someone is much more powerful than I am. I'll tell you that much. The forest workers and go over here and get another farm. We need more farms, goddammit. Gold darn it. And there we go. Finally, the wheel. So we can get mud paths and actually connect our cities with real roads. No one else is rising up? Good. You know, the fact that these two civilizations popped up kind of screws over. Because that means the game's going to go that much slower. And that's going to suck. Put your shoulder to the wheel. Thank you, Aesop. Alright, and you know what? Go and get the work boats. We do, in fact, need some of those. And get a farm. And... Go up here and get the lead. Some more lead. Alright, but you know what? This is where I'm going to have to end this episode. Yes, so... We finally got the wheel, which means mud paths can be a thing. Wow. What the hell are you guys? Are you guys trying to create a path to my lands? They have to. I mean, there's no other place they could be going. Portugal, I like you, but I kind of want to kill you. Sorry. All right. So thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Elira Toon. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.